So first, let's start. Let's start really simple with batting average. What is a batting average? Yeah. A batting average, well, put simply, is it's just your average. I guess just getting on base of the hit, right? I mean, <laughs> how do you explain Tell it? Tell us, Brad. Well, but so it's, it's really you know, simple. You know, it's just it's well. I mean, I don't know, but it's this. <laughs> um, <laughs> but the way you calculate your batting average is, is actually pretty simple and actually like pretty cool, in my opinion, because it's the number of hits, number of base hits you get for the no- like over divided by the number of official like at bats you get. It's not number of times you get on base over plate appearances because that would be on base percentage. Am I right? Yep. So yeah, like, it's it it all, all it is is hits divided by at bats. That's it. Yeah, because if you get up there and you hit a sack fly, that doesn't count as a, as an at bat. If you because the ball did not get put error, in play. If you reach on an error, that's not a hit, but it counts as an at bat. That's right. So, so a lot of people really have a hard time with batting average, and there's this entire mm-hmm. faction of baseball, um, baseball, whatever that word was, baseball <laughs> fandom, that <laughs> that wants to get away and just do away with batting average all the way around. I don't fit mm-hmm. that category. I'm old school. I think it tells a big chunk of the story. I think it's the most easily digestible offensive statistic. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and you know, we a lot of people are going back and applying new sabermetrics, new statistical analysis to previous seasons and even mm-hmm. the legendary stuff, which I think is tremendous. It's super cool. But this one is enduring, and it is a little antiquated, but it, it still, I think, tells a segment of the story, and I think that's valuable. I totally agree with you because – I mean, the standard batting average, the standard for batting average has dropped with launch angle because guys are getting out a ton more. You know, there's yes. more focus on slugging OPS. We'll get into that in a little bit. But still, though, like, you're, you're, we're still waiting for somebody to hit 400. Yep. Right? And it's still, if somebody hits 330, it's like, wow. 350, especially, it's like, wow. That's awesome. You know, so... There is still some weight put on it, but it's not necessarily a statistic that's looked at like the be all end all because there are more advanced stats that that are used. Yeah, right. So yeah, and obviously yeah. statistics have have come a long way because of computers and technology and all of the people that care. So mm-hmm. all of those revolutionary ideas have changed the way we view baseball and baseball statistics. But mm-hmm. per- particularly interesting is the ones that have lasted forever. Some of which need to go away, and we'll get into that in a little bit. But I think <laughs> yes, I like I like this one. Yeah, I, like I, this one I do lot, like batting so. average. Yes. So we talked, and it is still or, tied to an award, isn't it? Still tied to an award. Like the batting title, yeah, yeah. So is it, and is so there's the legitimacy right there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely. 